I'm Tree. This is The Shinies, which is a subsect of Project Transparency. And I would like to apologize in advance for the horrible sound that's going on in the background because my neighbors are ripping out a tree stump and have been for a couple weeks and making me very, very cranky with all the noise. And I also have a really bad head cold, so I sound just darling. Look at it. Isn't it beautiful? It's kind of thin this month. I kind of, I wonder what's in it. So this month's loot crate is terror because October and Halloween. So let's cut into the thing and find out what it is. Always helps to open it right set up. Okay, so the first thing on top is a t-shirt. It's a skull made out of kitties. That's very exciting. It's very cute. See? Skull made out of kitties. That makes me kind of weirdly happy. There's also a Loot Crate official member card. So, I wonder if the, you get this when you've had three months of Loot Crate or six months or something. I don't know. It's in there. <laughs> How to survive a Sharknado and other natural disasters. Fantastic. So it can go beside my uh, guide to zombies book. How to survive the zombie apocalypse book. Same person who wrote World War Z. And it is distributed but and is distributed by sci-fi channel Siffy sci-fi channel god it has giant squids and dino sharks and things in it and prehistoric bears and mega python fantastic stonehenge apocalypse so basically it's a guide to all of the really bad sci-fi channel disaster movies which is fantastic because those things are simultaneously the worst and best things in the history of ever. A cute little Walking Dead fan art. It's very cute. I don't watch Walking Dead. I, tr I got about halfway through the first season and was bored out of my skull, so... But it's still very, very cute, and I, I do actually know what's going on there, so... That's always good. And I like fan art. Fan art makes me happy. There is this mysterious box that says Dead Rising 3 that needs to be cut open because tape there we go and it is a tiny little weapon that would that would do Ash Proud so cool I have a little replica weapon thing from Dead Rising 3. That's kind of cool, actually. And because no viewing of Rocky Horror Picture Show complete without them, real old school 3D glasses. Fantastic. Or I guess the Doctor Who Marathon. There are also zombie bite tattoos, perfect for Halloween. A unlocking an unlocking code for curse not the entire game just like Thanos, Thanatos and a Jack the Reaper skin I haven't played curse so I don't know toxic waste candy oh it's fear it's not terror it's fear so you know I was going for the stronger word in my description, but it's got zombies on it. The official Loot Crate magazine guide thing for fear. And a Walking Dead comic. That's very exciting. And the Loot Crate box is basically like something out of Walking Dead, which is really cool. 
and it if you have gotten this month's loot crate make sure to put on your official old school 3d glasses and look at the box because it's kind of trippy all right so that was <clears throat> the October Loot Crate Fear Unboxing with all the noise in the history of ever and I'm really sorry about that and very zombie oriented and very cool so yes if you haven't tried Loot Crate yet and you like geek culture and pop culture and t-shirts and fan art and video games you should really give it a shot actually very difficult to move around with these horns.